Hello, everyone. I am Kudafo. And we're back at this game. Yep, let's go. So last time, we were... Who were we again? We from the looks of it, we were Koto Hime. Well, I guess we are being uh, Chiari or Yumemi later anytime soon. So next up is Kana. Let's go. How you guys doing today? Happy Friday. Really fun. Really cool. We know I'm always curious. Now then. Let's do this. Next one, please. A shrine maiden. How old fashioned. Holds against me, it was kinda, yep. Versus Kotohime. Let's be honest, Kotohime is the lunatic princess. I have no clue what she's talking about, ever. She has a good theme though, I do like it. The win for me. Next. Looks like there's nothing but weird people around here. Agreed. Kana versus Kana. One with a really good one on this. Really good song. Really good theme.
Next fight. Bring it on. How about Jump Street as well? Fighting myself and all. Kana versus Mima. Close one. Very close. <laughs> Too close. You definitely don't have legs. Kana versus Marisa. the most level-headed Toho character. Who would have thought there would be such a thing? That was way easier than the last one. Who's left, or was that it? An oriental sorcerer? What a weirdo. Ah, Rikako. You use a jetpack. Neat.
There's only one person left. Huh, is that right? There, these people are no problem. Oh, Aiden. The one who wanted to build a store at Amu's shrine. Yep. Hear me once. I always run into them. Weak, all of them. How boring. I just noticed I'm the only one left. That means I beat them all. Anyways, I guess I'm allowed to enter the ruins now. Whoa. So many lines. On button. It's in English. Click. These ancients all have some amazing culture. Don't move. What? What? So you're the strongest magic user, are you? Come with me immediately. What are you talking about? This may look small, but it's a lethal weapon. If you value your life, you'll do as I say. Are you an ancient? Of course not. The ancient's culture is nothing more than that of monkeys. The any ancient's playing, I'm sorry. And I can't believe you still think these are ruins. So are they aren't ruins? Never mind, just come with me. Wait. Whack. Who told you to grant such poor hospitality? But it's more fun this way. Double whack! You're scaring the guests we've been waiting for. What? Uh, please forgive our wrong reception. Who are you, second ancient? Uh, I mean, Miss Alien? What are you calling an alien? Aliens are slippery and slimy like octopi or squids. Don't creep us up with them. Twenty aliens playing, I'm sorry. Again, I am the ship's captain, Yumemi Okazaki. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm our crew member, Shiyuri Katashirakawa. Nice to meet you. Wait a moment, did you just say ship? Is this your ship? That's right. Well, we call it a ship, but it doesn't float along the water, or glide through clouds, or drift through space, or anything like that. The ship is called a probability space hyper vessel. 
I've come out, I've been here on the ship in search of something that doesn't fit into the grand unified theory. There's magic all over the place for a comparative physicist. I'm far too lucky. Anyway, I don't really understand, but you guys just popped up from somewhere, like maggots or something. Why do you have to pop out of somewhere? Why do we have to pop Don't compare us to maggots, please. 20 maggots playing, etc. We came from another world, we call that world the probability world. It's a different world, but it's in the same dimension. Are you talking about parallel worlds? Is that what you call them here? It must be the same thing. So what did you come here for? I said this before, but I came in search of magic. Can't you find that anywhere you go? Not in our world. That's why I need to examine your power. How? We just have to fight. I'll just observe you while you're doing it. Will you help me? For free? Um, of course not. That is, well... If you're a particularly strong magic user, I'll grant you whatever you wish. Fight is within my power. But if it's weak, we don't need it. That's fine. You can't use magic, can you? Again, you do it. This would be easy. Well then, do your best shooting on the modern in this world of magic in the meantime. By that, you mean... Yeah, I mean, I want you to fight her. Man, I was afraid of that. Whack! Quit whining and defeat her in this instant. You have my scientific magic, don't you? I don't expect you to win, but if you lose right away, we'll be able to understand anything at that time. I'll gather data. No way out of this, huh? Let's fight. You think you can win? Kaba versus Chiyuri! I don't know what's happening! That was weird. That was a really weird round. Chiyuri, you lost too fast, but no buts and no rear ends either. I couldn't get nearly enough data. Jeez, you had a woman could have just put her under and taken her home. What was that? That's right, I finally found the beautiful power called Magic in School. I won't sell for just observations anymore. I'm going to take it back as a test specimen, study the power and make it mine. I thought so. The thought of granting a wish was too good to be true. And that's what you feel, I have no choice to resist. I see, I'll have to use all my power in order to fight you. If you beat me, I'll give you what you wish. However, if I win, you'll come to our world. That's okay, right? Even though it's not like you, I'm giving you a choice. You'll grant my wish? Suddenly, my will to fight is returning. Hold on, just one. I need to change my battle wear. Hurry up. Okay, I'm ready. All you do is put on the cape. 
give it your all. If you die, I can't take you back to me after all. Same to you. Okay, here I come. Let's do this already. What was your theme called? Something che cherry something? Oh, well, regardless, it's a cool theme. I like it. Definitely up there with one of my favorites. Okay, here we go. There we go! <laughs> so I wasn't able to be real magic after all. How frustrating. Why was I born in this world? Now it's kind of this. I'll show you the true power of science. Take this, I plan destroying fourth dimensional po positron bomb! Cut it out already! If you do that, we'll go down and to the bad guys. Those folding chairs hurt. Jeez, I was only joking, wasn't it obvious? Well, I have no choice, I'll give up on learning magic. But I was able to quite, collect quite a lot of data, but I can present a report to the Academy. Magic is real, close related to religion. It can solve our energy crisis and environment issues. It will save mankind! And somehow that seems off. Anyways, I promise the promise, I will give you whatever you desire. I'd be waiting for this. But for your information, I'm only human, so nothing too crazy. Right now, there's a certain mansion I've been haunting. But the people who live there 
They aren't scared of me anymore because of that. I've been so bored. It's not time for me to move to a different place, but they call, right? You can leave that to us. You can do that? Uh, probably. So where do you want to move to? That shrine would be great. Understood. I'll move you there without fail. Mmm, thank you. Well then, maybe meet again someday. Later. As promised, Kana now has to shrine. Come on, you're so noisy, I can't sleep. Cha! <laughs> it's nighttime, so keep it down. But I'm a noisy ghost. Why are you even haunting my place? I'm a shrine maid, you know? Because it's fun. I'm going to exercise you from this place. Cha! <laughs> but as for whether Rain was able to exercise Kana, that's a different story. End. And so we move on to the next one. Begin! Next up, Rikako! Begin! Versus Mima! What a weird move. Day now. Cool. Next one. Your existence is affected by magic as well, I see. Rikako versus Rikako! Next one. You're are we both the real thing? Mari's first is Marisa Kirisame.
even though you're wearing those clothes, your magic is only that powerful. Versus the confusing Kotohime. Be a good girl and go home. The Dikako versus the Rema. Begin! You know, these can take a while. Didn't need to use that, but whatever. You mean that's it? I thought you were a shrine maiden. Dikaka versus Aiden.
I still don't know what that is. Uh, anyway. Hmm, only one more person did not have to beat them all. The last one looks like a weak girl. Too bad for her. The Kaka versus Kana. Not already. Hurry up and fall. There we go. That was tricky. I knew that I was the strongest. Power saving from these roots is definitely not magic. This could be what I've been looking for. I defeat all my opponents, so I should be able to get in now. On button. Click. What is this? Don't move! Huh? What? See the strongest magic user, are you? Come with me immediately. Who's there? Well, I am the one intruding. This may look small, but it's a legal weapon. If you value life, you'll do as I say. Snotty belligerent. What is that weapon? Is that the thing that turns even monkeys into that when it hits? What's that? This is a weapon from another world. Anyways, come with me. Wait a second. Whack. Who told you to grant such poor hospitality? But it's more fun this way. Double whack. You're scaring the guests we've been waiting for. Oh? Ah, uh, please forgive our odd reception. Uh, no, I... More importantly, where are we exactly? These don't look like historic ruins. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I am Yumemi Okazaki, a comparative physics professor. I'm Chiyuri... Chiyuri Katashi Shirakawa. I'm Lady Yumemi's assistant. Ah, uh, pardon me. I'm Rikaku Asakura. In regards to your previous question, this is a probability space hypervessel. I've come here on the ship in search of something that doesn't fit into the Grand Unified Theory. There are too many words I don't understand. You, you said earlier that you're from a different world? That's right. You're pretty sharp. May I ask a question? What is the source of power here? Hmm? It's nuclear fusion energy. But, but what about it? So is it magic power? Ah, I see. This power doesn't exist in this world. Yes, in this world, magic unifies everything. Worlds like that, as well as worlds that are the opposite, and those with a mixture of the two exist. At least that was my theory. But I was right after all. The thing that magic actually exists here. I see. That's very fascinating. Why are you have you invited people out here? Why have you invited people out here? That's because I want to use them to research magic, of course. Would you like to assist me? What's in it for me? Uh, well, um... 
It should particularly strong magic user. I'll uh, grant you any wish, provided it's within my power. But if it's weak, we don't need it. I look forward to it. So what should we do then? We just have to fight. I'll just deserve you while you're doing it. How about it? Will you help me? That's fine. I have to fight you, right? I very much see non-magical power. Well then, do your best, Judy. I'll be monitoring this world of magic in the meantime. By that you mean, I mean I want you to fight her. Man, I was afraid of that. Double whack! Quit whining and defeat her in this instant. You have my side of magic, don't you? I don't expect you to win, but if you lose right away, you won't be able to understand anything. In that time, I'll gather data. No way out of this, huh? Let's fight! Mm -hmm. Here we go! Good. Cutie, you lost too fast. But no buts and no rear ends either. I couldn't get nearly enough data. Jeez, if you had one, we could have just put her under and taken her home. What was that? That's right, we finally found a beautiful power called magic in this world. I won't sell as much of some vicious anymore. I'm going to get back to the test of some saying that power men make it mine. I knew something smelled fishy. However, your artificial magic isn't anything special. How exactly do you plan on bringing me back? My sort of magic is, after all, merely an imitation magic. It can't fail against the real thing. It doesn't use magic, it is a thing born of po only positively charged photons and light waves. However, I saw through your attacks while you were fighting Chudi. I have an adva advantageous position. So you're going to use brute force? Alright, if you can manage to defeat me in battle, I'll grant you what you wish. However, if I win, you'll come back for a world. That should suffice, even though it's not like I'm giving you a choice. No matter what, I won't lose. Here we go! Hold on just one, I need to change my battle wear. What's that? Okay, I'm ready. All you do is put on the cape. Give it your all, if you die, I won't can't take you back with me after all. I got it. Okay, here I come. Don't underestimate me. Dikaku versus Yumemi Okazaki. Strawberry Crisis. That's the name of this theme.
They got hit! go without a single continue not bad so I wasn't able to see real magic after all how frustrating why was I born in this world that's from this I'll show you my true power side if I take this my planet destroying fourth dimensional plus have positive drop bomb bonk cut out already if you do that we'll go down history as the bad guys those holy just hurt Jeez, I was only joking wasn't it obvious well, I have no other choice. I will give you. I'll give up on learning magic. But I was able to collect quite a lot of data, and I can present the report to the academy. Magic is real. Closely related to religion, it can solve our energy crisis and environmental issues. It will save my kind. And somehow that seems off. Anyways, a promise is a promise. I will give you whatever you desire. Mm hmm. Let's see. If you're rich, I'm only human, so I don't. So nothing too crazy. Mm hmm. I want the science tools you possess. Come again. The science from your world surpasses ours by 500 years. So I want your knowledge. An easy request. And I shall give you a book that will teach you about our science. Here you are. Fifth grade science. Hooray, it's science. What kind of cover is this? Hmm, <laughs> thank you. So I'm ready to give something like that to her? This world science is much more primitive than ours. I gave them something too complicated. They would not understand it. What was that? Nothing, nothing. Now it is time for us to depart. Have a safe trip. Later. Experiments of progress stay out. This is amazing. I knew there was a force more powerful than magic in this world. This perhaps going to bring peace to this world. Though this world already seems pretty peaceful. Oh, what happens when I mix these two together? And so Rikaku became a famous scientist in Gensokyo. Oh, I'm not. It's a little hard to tell. And... And thus, we only have two more to go. We'll play this game eventually. But until then, take care, everyone. Have a great day!